Georgia. Welcome and Georgia. Tu, 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 tu. Welcome to Georgia. Welcome to Georgia. <laughs> All right, guys, it's our very last day in Tuskal Tubo, the land of abandoned Soviet buildings and Soviet trucks, actually. We're now going to go for our final few hours and explore some abandoned Soviet sanatoriums, ones you haven't seen yet, and hopefully find Stalin's bath, where he used to hang out. Let's do it. Let's go. But it does sound like there's some party going on up here. Yeah. I think we should check it out. Yeah, let's crash this party. Wow. Abandoned sanatorium party. <laughs> huh? Ah. Спасибо большое. Спасибо не говорят. Это у нас, знаете как, мы грузины, мы любим уважать гостей. Никогда уважаем, мы спасибо не берем. Хорошо, тогда не буду говорить. Просто, просто, хорошо. Знаете за что вы? За что? Пьем. Сейчас мы находимся в Грузии. С Халдубу, город Дыбин. С Халдубу. Я хочу выпить за Грузию. А куда вы приехали? За тот город. Минск. Да, с Минска. Лондон. Лондон. Потом знаете почему? Потому что что-то нас связывает уже. Понимаете, вы с Минска, он с Лондона. Я в Грузии нахожусь. Мы встречаемся в Салтубу. Да. Но это все, но это все называется, знаете, как вот Как это? Сура. Сурам Рунтхуа, парламент Рогуртхуа. Сура? Судьба. Судьба. Не, не судьба. Случайно. Мы, мы, мы европейцы. Согласен. А, Зура Жвани. Мы европейцы. Конечно, все европейские люди. Да, конечно. Согласен. Мы, я, мы любим свободу, мы любим. Все вновь. И единая, короче, все. Свободу любим больше всего. Давайте тогда. Давайте. Спасибо за приглашение. Рад вам. Вы после, вы здесь 26 лет живете? 27. 27 лет. А. Вы были хоть раз у себя дома в Абхазии? Нет. А. Ни разу? Мара, у меня по синдерму в интернете, я имею друзей в Абхазии. Да. А, они мои кенты, мои друзья, да, короче, да, да. очень близко, и, короче, и... Он мне выслал фотографию, фотографию дома. моего дома. А. 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 О. И он выслал моего дома. Мы просто не задеваем вот этот очень такой вопрос. А. Больной вопрос. И он воевал, и я воевал. Я тоже там воевал, и он тоже воевал. Он против меня воевал, я против него воевал. Мара, мы не задеваем вот эту тему, которая очень для нас больна. To do a bong in Georgia, let's get absolutely slaughtered. It's my birthday. Welcome in Georgia. You never know what adventures you're going to get into when you're walking around the abandoned buildings of Tuskatublo or wherever it's called. Bongs, abandoned buildings, refugees from Abkhazia. Back in Soviet times, workers were given permission 
or even vouchers every year to go and visit a resort, a sanatorium. Of course, Soviet citizens couldn't go abroad except for the very, very well privileged. So they came and they made these sanatoriums all over the former Soviet Union. We're now in the central baths of Tuxaltubo. You can see here there was a ring of bars, so all your Soviet citizens would have sat in one each, and then the hot water would have bubbled out of there and fled down into each of the individual baths. You can imagine all the comrades here, and here there would have been probably back in the day a glass roof or something to let the light in. Now, of course, it's gone. And here was a central, a central well of hot water. These were the springs that made Tuxaltubo, the bloody name of the town I can't say, famous. People travelled from all over the Soviet Union to here. Here's some kind of, I don't know, some pictures on the wall of a flying nightingale or some type of bird. What do you reckon? And a deer. Ah, oh, and here we go, of course. Some Moldovans have bloody been on holiday here and drawn a knob. These dogs are crazy. These dogs are insane. <laughs> They have the maddest dogs here in Georgia. They're suicide dogs. <laughs> when they see a car coming, they just peg it towards the car and try and get run over. They've had enough of life in Georgia. <laughs> they can't take any more Khachapuri. They're like, fuck this life. Go back, Joba. A tak u nas 22 sanatori bila, 22 sanatori. I prijeżali Moskva, Tschaltuba, Poes. Каждый день одиннадцать вагон. Секундочку, прямо Москва сюда или куда Не, не, до сюда, до Цхалтуба и встречались автобусы. Понятно. Автобусы и что? Не на сезон нет. Постоянно и зимой у нас это были туристы и осень и лето и круглый год. Да, вот так выходило. В Англии. Или запад, мы думаем, что СССР это было плохо, люди были не счастливы, не, слушай, люди бед, были очень нет. бедные, они думают. Нет. Это неправда? Нет, неправда. Советский Союз, вот когда Брежнев руководил, тогда мы жили супер. Как Брежнев умер, да. то пришел Горбачев, Горбачев. Вот так пили этого и насчет шеварднации, они друг друга это перестройка. И правда перестройка. А. Все люди стали бедные. Понятно. Это была правда перестройка. О, нашел перестройки. За перестройка. There are so many hot springs and thermal springs under the ground here, that water just flows out of every crack. You can see here, just hot water, just running down the road, basically. Not far from here is the mineral town of Borjomi, which is Georgia's biggest export, the mineral water that is drunk all over the former Soviet Union. Wow, these dogs are insane. Wow. Check this place out. I mean, so this was the main vestibule, the main entrance of what was one of the most premier hot spring resort towns in all the Soviet Union. As I say, Stalin used to come here. I think Khrushchev was here. Maybe Brezhnev and Gorbachev, I don't know. I don't want to make stuff up. But let's check it out. Wow. It's like a Roman bathhouse kind of place. Look at it. Wow. Still got the old pillars here. Let me take my sunglasses off. Wow. Ben? Oh. Yeah. What's up? You're complaining that you don't have presents. Well, you got so me one. To my God, what is it? Hey, I'm so excited. Wow, a Soviet. Balustrade, yes, best present I ever received. Wow, can I take it home? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Will Ryan, will Ryan Air let me take it on the plane or will I get charged a ridiculous amount? 
All right, we've discovered a bit of a broken staircase. Alinchik's going first. Alinchik's braver than me, to be honest. She's got Soviet blood. She's a little bit braver than me. No fear, Alinchik. That's your new name. No fear, Alinchik. Is this lead? No. If this was lead, I'd be back here with a scrap truck, <laughs> stripping the bugger. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Oh, man. Uh huh. The view from the roof. Out. All right. Can you hear that Georgia music in the background? Everywhere you go in Georgia, you hear music. The music of the Caucasus. We found a polyglot here <laughs> in... <laughs> <laughs> О, да? Пят? Я аварец. Хорошо. Так, вы знаете русский? Нет, 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 аварец. Да, это... Тагестане есть. Тагестане. Хабиб на Магомедов. Хабиб на Магомедов, вот. Конечно. Вот мой нация. Понял, понял, понял. Аварец он. Который Макгрегора. Да, 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 да. И потом душил вот так вот его, черт. You were more connected to the Soviet Union than me. What did your family, I mean, who obviously your mum and your dad and your grandparents are all like living under the Soviet system, what did they think of the Soviet Union? Do they look back on it as something terrible or as something better than now? Or what, what, what's your opinion? Okay. Um... Don't be shy, just say whatever you think. Aline, she gets worried on camera. She's like, oh my God, what if I say something stupid? No, no, no. It's something okay. that everyone thinks when so... they're first on camera. Come on, just say whatever. Uh, my really? family had a lot of land before the communism came. Okay, fair enough. Uh, they had a lot of land in Siberia. And, okay. Um, Siberian chick. Oh, yes. Okay. And uh, basically, after the revolution came yep. and communism uh, took part, uh, everything was taken by government. Okay, so the Soviets confiscated your parents' land. Yes. Let's go up here. Okay, come on. I'm still. We're still talking. Yeah. Okay. So uh, that means I presume that your family are not big fans of the Soviet system. Um, they, okay, whatever, like, this happened. Okay, but I mean, <laughs> whatever, this happened, whatever. I mean, my family was sent to the gulag, yeah, whatever, it happened. All right then, let's check out some more, let's check out some more rooms here. Wow, here we go. You have to really imagine when you walk around these places, what was it like before, you know? What was happening here? Let's go into this room, look. A Soviet door. A Soviet room. With Soviet wallpaper. And here they would have had a balcony. Well, there is a balcony. And they would have had chairs here. And Mr. Berrier. And one of his victims would have been sitting here looking out across the lush countryside that is Georgia. Here we have an old Soviet bus stop from the later 80s period when they weren't using concrete anymore. They were using glass fibre. That's now just like rotted and stuff. I like the yellowness. That is so Soviet. Imagine the people that sat on here, sitting in the park, waiting to go for their turn at the thermal springs, chilling out, waiting for the bus to pick them up. Smoking cigarettes, Paparossi. So let me ask you this question then, like in Belarus particularly, are there, are sanatoriums still popular? Uh, yes, there are a lot of sanatoriums, but of course they're in better condition than uh, these ones we saw today. <laughs> yeah, okay. Uh, and uh, it's quite popular, people yeah. are going there every year once at least. Okay, do your family go there, do you go there? 
Um, me, no, it's okay. for older people. But okay. for example, my grandfather, hi, grandpa, wow. uh, and his wife are going. We can finally meet granddad. We can go to a sanatorium <laughs> and hang out with granddad, finally. Yes. All so right. it's very popular. So just think guys, the star is in this very bath, naked, having a little banya, probably drinking a little bit of vodka. Wow. I guess I'm sitting here. Let the minutes know. More than this, yes. Spend my birthday in Stalin's own bathhouse. This town, this town, Tuxaltobo, is like something from the bloody Twilight Zone. <laughs> it's like, I don't know, Twin Peaks or something. You come here and everything's just weird and not like the rest of the world. It's as if you've entered some kind of strange other world. Everything about it is just freaky and weird and. I don't know. Tuxal Tubo, stick it on your tourist itinerary. Forget Benidorm, forget Cancun, forget Ibiza. Come here, do some bongs, explore some Soviet buildings, have a good time. Tuxal Tubo, most messed up place you'll ever see. <laughs>